an almost two hours drive out of Port Mosby on the Magi Highway is Ganimarupu village in the Rigo district of Central Province. With government assistance, a training center is slowly taking shape there to accommodate women and girls who are social outcasts. We've been like this for so long and with the blessings that we got from the national planning, this is what we did. We have built our center, our teacher's home, we have bought a big truck to transport us to and from. And uh, now we have done it all. We are looking forward to um, looking forward for a tractor to come in so that we can do all the farming here. Because that's big demand here, farm. Is Margaret Anton is a widow with three children. She lost her home after an eviction. After engaging with Women of Hope, she now lives here in Ganimarupu. She has a home and has taken up farming to sustain her family. We have piles and piles of clothes. We don't have to look for clothes. And uh, we are always full. Back in the city, like, we get up 6 o'clock in the morning and we go out and try to find food for the children, mm -hmm. for ourselves, so that we can be able to take them down with our medication. Sometimes we go without food, mm -hmm. but over here we have everything. Women of Hope has a strong partnership with the women in business. Their mission to empower women with economic skills ties in with Women in Business mission to engage more local PNG women in small to medium enterprises. This prompted the granting of a 10 hectare piece of land to women in business. And for us to just come, uh, we feel that we're going to add value and we're going to bring a lot of uh, economic uh, opportunities and activities to the area here where we drove miles and miles with you know stretches of land with no people living. Like we had few villages here and there, so there's a huge potential to develop here. The land belongs to Veronica and her family. She plans to expand the center in Ganimarupu by building dormitories to accommodate all those who are under her care. There is sufficient resource available to expand on agriculture activities. With the support of women in business, Veronica hopes those who are under the care of Women of Hope can begin a new and sustainable livelihood.